Okay, this is day four, session um, two, or session four, part two, whatever. I need to drink of water first. Ready to go. Yes, good girl. All right, where did I put your leash? Put it over here. Okay. So I always start with a couple calms. She's already coming now, but I don't know. I like to consider it our warm up. Go. Yes, good girl. Um, I'm going to make it a little harder this time um, behind you. I know you can't see the mess, but trust me, there's a lot of kid toys and stuff. So I'm going to walk through it. I'm going to see if she's going to get distracted by something. No, she didn't. She's she's too good. Oh my goodness, there's no stump in this one, huh? Yes, good girl. Um, make sure... All of it. Come, puppy, come. Yes, good girl. She just followed us. She was like a ball. Oh, there's a chew toy. <laughs> she didn't even see where it went. Look at your chew toy. She's like, I don't know what game you're playing. Look at your chewy. It's your Chewy. What do you think about that? No? Yeah, she loves this thing. Oh no, she's going with it. Good girl, puppy come, puppy come. <laughs> Good girl. I was just trying to find something to distract her to make it a little harder for her to come. Because it's really easy for her to come when there's no distraction. Good, she's, yes, come. Good. Although we've been working in this area, so I guess it's not very distracting. Anyway, we did a couple comes. Try to put some distractions in there. Uh, no, no. No, no. Yes, good girl. All right. Good girl. You ready to do some work? So this will be more like the session or one should have been um, because we spent the first session just reviewing everything because we had so much time off. This will be more like a session four uh, one. So you do the five minutes reviewing everything that we've gone over and then the last five minutes I'm going to introduce the gown today. Hip portal. So timer for five minutes. So um, earlier I was working more on her skills, which is like the sit, the stay, the down. Um, I was working more on those because I had to make up lost time for uh, regression of the three days that, you know, I was sick, which I still am sick. Right? 
Um, anyway, so uh, we're going to work more on our leash work this time because that time I was doing more of our skills work. Let's go. Good girl. Yes. Very good. She like prances around. Is that not the cutest thing in the world? If that's not the cutest thing in the world, I don't know what is. What is the girl? What's up? This time we're gonna stop and we're gonna do it down. Safira, would I touch turkey? Time, but we weren't working. Let's go. Let's see, she just is back to her hooking self. Good girl. What's up? They just learn so much with so little at this age. When they're over 14 weeks, you have to try harder to get more. Good. Yes. Good girl. Let's go. And she, she's, she knows that when she goes down and I pull my hand away from her, she's supposed to stay there. Watch. Do it again. Down. Yes. And that was just from working on it this morning. Down. Down. All the way. Yes. Look at that. You saw everything I've been doing. Look at that. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. That's excellent. So you can see, look at this, I'm even standing up. Good girl. Let's go. She's ready for the down stay. You can tell. Let's go. Good girl. Okay, we're going to do stay. Stay. Yes. See, now I'm able to move both feet where this morning I wasn't able to. Let's go. My leash work is even better as she goes around the wrong side. Let's go. Good girl. Hey, portal. Set a five minute timer. Let's go. I'm 
around the other side a little bit. Let's go. She's really annoyed at that collar. Okay, so I'm going to do a couple more stays because the down stay builds off of the stay. And if the stay isn't good, the down stay is not going to be good. Hey, little playful monkey, stay. Did it kind of move? Yes. But it, um, you know, sometimes I can't tell if it's just her slipping. We're going to do another one. Sit. Stay. Fingers out. Stay. Yes, that's very clear that she understands. Let's go. I'm gonna do another one right in front of the camera so you can see. Let's go. That this is very clear that she understands what this means. Stay. Yes, she understands because we laid the foundation literally this morning. You guys all saw the video. Okay, let's go. I'm going to walk all the way around it, and then we're going to introduce the down stay. Silly. You're so silly. Let's go. Come on, silly. She should have named you silly, Lily. You're so silly. Good girl. Let her treat the sit. Down. Treat the down. Stay. Ah. Down, stay, down, stay. Ah. Okay, so I'm moving my feet, it's too much for her. Down, stay, yes. Let's go. This way. Girl, treat the sit. Down. Stay. Yes, good girl. Good stay. Let's go. Um, I even that time I said good good stay. So sometimes I tell her what it was that she was doing good. Down. Stay. Stay. Ah. Down. Stay. Ah. Stay. Yes. So she was chewing on her leash. If she's chewing on her leash, she's not paying attention. Let's go. Okay, now I'm going to do a sit stay. Stay. Yes. She did move, but it was because she was slipping on the floor. Let's go. Good girl. We're going to walk all the way around. Let's go. Good girl. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Good girl. Sit. Stay. Yes. You can tell she has a clear understanding of what that means. Let's go. Good girl. Now we're going to see if it translates. Down. Stay. Yes. Good job. Good job. Oh my gosh, I'm out of treats. Let's go. Get portal. Show me my timer. My timer is so mean to me. I feel like it didn't even set it. So, if you're struggling with one step, go back to the previous step. As you saw, I did the sit stay, and then right after did the down stay, she was able to make that connection. This is the same thing, I'm just changing positions. Sit, so we'll do it again. Stay, yes. Let's go, break it up. Good girl, good girl, sit. Down, stay. Look at that. That's a good job. She did pop up, but I got really excited. Down, there you go. Mommy got excited that time. How could you not? She's so perfect. Good girl. 
understands this day I stood more upright that time and kind of held my treat a little higher because she's ready for it down stay good girl down and do one more stay ah, stay see it wasn't clear that ah, ah. down stay there we go. Good girl. Good job. Good job. And as long as she's down here, she gets more treats. She gets more treats. She gets more treats. Good girl. And then we take off the phone. Good girl. Good girl. Oh, what's our color, Ricky? Okay. Okay. Make sure you give a release command. Okay, okay. Oh my goodness. Now all our bad habits come back. Because mom just can't resist your rage. You're too cute. That was an excellent day four, session one, even. Um, you struggle with the down stay, go back to the sit stay, do the down stay right after. So she can make that connection. Oh, I just did that. But now I'm laying down, but I can still do that. And you could see what a big difference it made. Um, that last one that I did, I did it twice. And you could see that I did it. Sorry, I'm pregnant. Ugh, I can't breathe. Um, you saw I did a down stay. She did stay there, but I feel like she wasn't focused. And I was right, because when I did it one more time, she popped up. So I was right, she wasn't paying attention that first time wasn't clicking with her. So I'm glad I did it one more time to make sure that this is exactly what I'm asking you to do. There should be no question that she understood. So um, I don't know if you could tell in the video, the first time I asked for that last down stay, she just wasn't focused. It was just chance that she was laying there and I was moving, but it wasn't because she knew that she was not supposed to follow me. If that makes sense, I don't know. Hopefully you can see that. So hopefully this helps you out. Whew. That's only 10 minutes. I'm out of breath. I don't even know where my puppy went. Oh. Oh. Good girl. Good girl. Yeah. Good girl. Trust me, your labradoodles are not as hard. They're even easier. Because Cavaliers, they love you so much. I mean, Labradoodles love you so much, but they're like so excitable over it. So it's hard to get them to focus. <laughs> um, at a young age, where the Labradoodles at a young age, they already have that focus coming out of the breeder. So um, it's easier to build on that. But if you don't build on it, you get an older dog who's acting like this and it's harder to control because it's big, bigger. But I would suggest, cause I know that a couple of you went to the, um, the CGC training at the park and the older dogs are showing this kind of thing where they're not focused, they're really excitable, they're really excited. So if you do this stuff at home, and lay down that foundation of exactly what is expected. Then when you go out to a place that's high energy, then you have something to fall back on. And uh, yeah, anyway, I don't know why I'm spewing. I need to catch my breath. All right, have a good night.